Hey there everyone, this is Dana Shea and today I wanted to share a video with you because I was inspired by my dog. Yep, that's right, my dog. This morning I was letting the dog out and the kids had actually told me a couple days ago that he's been getting out. When we go outside, he's in the front yard. Well, he's not supposed to be in the front yard because we let him out in the backyard. So how is he getting out? So a couple of months ago, we had discovered that this smart little dog had found this little tiny opening underneath our fence and he was actually getting underneath the fence and going you know all over the neighborhood and the neighbor's yard and what have you well we fixed that little small opening and we thought we were okay because for months he's been going where he's supposed to go doing his business coming back in no problems right well today I noticed that he had been getting out again and so I pulled my blinds up and I watched him get out and I said how in the world is he getting out of these little small spaces now we treat our dog well he's not trying to run away but he is determined that he is going to go out into the land of freedom he does not want to be caged up in this backyard and so therefore he is going to do whatever he has to do to get out he is going to find his way to freedom and as I started just thinking about the lesson of that, I thought, you know, how many of us in life are in situations where we feel boxed in? Maybe you're on a job that you don't like, or maybe you're doing something with your life that you don't really want to do, and you feel like, you know what, I just can't get out of this place. I want to encourage you to do what my dog did. Find a way out. No matter what you have to do, whether you have to struggle through a small little tiny opening, whether you have to go and circumvent the backyard to try to find another way out, whatever you do, you need to be tenacious and you need to be persistent. Now, when I first started my speaking business, you know, I honestly wasn't really interested in speaking for a living. I knew that, you know, I had these messages that I believe God had given me. I've been through some stuff in my life that I've had some experience with to help other people. And I really honestly just kind of started off just as a hobby, you know, just kind of, you know, people called me and they asked me to speak to their group. I would speak, but I wasn't doing any active marketing. I wasn't really trying to promote myself as a speaker. Well, that changed after I published my book. Once I published my book and I started getting people to say, hey, can you come and talk to our group about what you've gone through in your life? Hey, can you come and encourage our young people about making wise choices? And so I began to kind of take a look at the speaking thing a little bit more um, in detail. And I'll tell you that it hasn't been a smooth road all the time. There definitely been humps and hurdles and bumps and you know all sorts of things. But just like I'm encouraging you, you to do, I have to remind myself to be persistent and to persevere. I truly believe that if you really want something in your life, if you're willing to go after it, and if you're willing to keep going and not give up, when that opening is closed off to you, find another opening. When one person tells you no, that's okay. Smile, be good to people, don't burn bridges, and move on. Find somebody else. Find someone who will tell you yes, and keep going. Just don't give up. And I think honestly, that's probably one of my greatest strengths in life is the ability to persevere. And it's something that I really believe I've been gifted with from God. But even if you feel like you haven't been necessarily gifted in that area, I want to encourage you that you can still continue to persevere no matter what you're going through. Just don't give up. Because guess what? If you give up, you lose. But if you keep on trying, I believe you're going to find that answer. You're going to find that way. You're going to hear that yes. You're going to get that promotion. You're going to find that relationship, whatever it is that you're looking for in life. So I hope that this story about my dog has encouraged you today to don't give up on your dreams, to persevere, to keep going because you are going to reach whatever journey, destination, dream that you have in your heart. I truly believe that. So thanks so much for watching this video. I want to encourage you to head on over to my blog at danashay.com slash blog. I've got some really good articles there for you. And if you ever want to guest blog or maybe just reach out to me and say, hey, Dana, you know, I love watching your videos. You're very inspirational and encouraging to me. I want to encourage you to reach out to me on social media. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, everywhere. So go ahead and just click on any of the links at the top of my channel and I would be more than happy to meet you and connect with you. So thanks so much for watching this video. Have a great day.